Hi, in the previous video, I stopped with an application where I ended with an application that was about the message. So control alt T, I ran something that changed my D message completely. So there are no more messages of audit, etc. all inside of there. It's just the normal standard stuff that I see all the time. And this is for me much more readable and I can follow up on changes in here. So if you like what you're seeing, then the script is there for you on the Linux Nemesis. No audit messages anymore. Now, I told you that my Linux B deeping is going to be my system for the coming, well, weeks, right? So the thing is, I'm missing quite a lot still. Even after installing Arch Linux Nemesis, there are things that I require for my, my, my workflow. And one of the things, whoops, one of the things is that I require Vivaldi to be having a extension. One of the extensions that I do like is a password. Oh, this is one. So add to Chrome, add extension, just wait a bit and it's here. And all I need to do is, is if you want to get started, almost done, add to browser, login. All the, the only thing I need to do is actually sign in and everything will be okay. So that's the thing I'm going to do right now, and I'm going to pause the video. All right, the icon is red, so you see up here. So it means it was been I've installed it and I've logged in already, and I have 13 accounts apparently for GitHub alone. Great, probably not, but anyway, the last pass is installed. And then Vivaldi has also something called a synchron. We can sorry, we can sync our um, settings and our bookmarks and all that to uh, Vivaldi and get it back. So um, after any clean installation, I'm going to sync everything back and um, I'm going to pause the video here too. Now, before the bookmarks hit me and everything is synchronized, I'm going to go to manage bookmarks and I'm going to delete all these things because they're going to be, voila, they're going to be, the new ones are going to be added and all the extra extensions I've installed are going to be installed as well. So everything is now looking good. I have my raindrop up here. I have my start, my Art Linux, Art Linux web, Art Linux repo. So everything is now here uh, available on this machine, new SSD, just installed. And all I need to do is sign in, the sign in button here and last pass will kick in and log me in. The same thing I'm gonna do over for Firefox. So this is Vivaldi, Vivaldi is done. But Firefox is uh, not done. So Vivaldi for me is the Eric Dubois account and uh, Firefox is the Arch Linux account and Chromium is for anything else really. Um, so I'm doing, going to do the same thing here. Sing, sign in to sync, sign in, and I'm gonna pause the video. I'm missing a year last pass as well. Maybe do that uh, in advance. Add-ons, scroll down, find more add-ons. Look for password managers, last pass, add to Firefox, edit. By the way, uh, you can do this also with an app in EOR. So just type yay or trizen and then last pass, you'll see them come up. So again, I'm gonna go dark here. I'm gonna pause the video and log in here. That's one thing, but also log in here to the sign in the same thing is going to happen here. Okay. So Firefox is, has, has been signed in. Everything is syncing already. So this is an old page and we can go to Google B or something and make my connection, which is quite easy. Just click on it. And then he says here what to choose. A drop down comes out and I choose my account and my password and done. Let me do just that quickly. So everything has synced. When I open now Control Alt F or Firefox, everything and all tabs are being opened. I'm logged in everywhere. LastPass is filling in all my logins and passwords. I wouldn't know what they are. Login, the LastPass manager knows it. So you see all these elements uh, are here and opened. And I'm logged in as Arclinix and any other browser Vivaldi, I'm logged in as Eric Dubois. And it's as simple as that. So I'm getting more and more ready to teach. I'm setting everything up the way I like. 
and um, I think we're better call it a day here. So this is basically all about the browsers and getting synced. There are in Firefox and in Vivaldi, there are possibilities of a cloud account so that everything is kept in the cloud. And once you have a new installation, you get it back and you get also your, your extensions back and all that. So, and even your themes, it's, it's beautiful. All right, see you in the next video.